Welcome to Loris Recycle. We're going to take you through our materials recovery facility, or MRF, here in Saskatoon and show you just what happens to all the recycling you put in your blue cart. We process 150 tons of material here every single day, which is about the same weight as a blue whale. All of the material is processed at a rate of 20 to 22 tons per hour using specialized machines and hand sorting. Once it's been collected from your neighborhood, we load all of the material onto our conveyor belt using this drum feeder. First stop is pre-sort. This belt is moving at 70 meters per minute. The employees who work here are very fast and accurate at their job. They're looking for a few things, shredded paper, plastic film, garbage, hazardous goods, and glass. Shredded paper should be coming to us in a clear or clear colored bag. These bags get opened up, emptied into the shredded paper bin, while the plastic film bag gets sent up the vacuum tube above. Next, we're looking for household hazardous goods. Sadly, we see a lot of dangerous items here at our facility, such as propane tanks, weapons, needles, and more. When one of these items is seen, the line is stopped for it to be safely removed. These items could hurt one of our employees, so it's so important that you safely dispose of these items and not try to recycle them in your blue bin. Lastly, we're looking for garbage and glass. Both of these items need to be hand-picked off the line here at Presort. The next few stations are all sorted by size and material. First up is cardboard. Cardboard is the biggest item that we sort. We sort it using OCC cardboard sorting stars. All smaller and heavier items fall through the stars and onto the next station while the larger cardboard floats over top of the stars and then onto a human manned quality control station. The next station is paper, which is sorted very similarly to cardboard. We use a slightly smaller set of stars to separate the paper from everything else. We also use a paper magnet to sort out paper from the other materials. This is a belt with tens of thousands of little holes in it and a high powered suction behind it. All the paper sticks to the belt while heavier items fall off. Once again, after it's been through machines, it goes through a manned quality control station. Next up, household tin. We use a ferrous magnet to pull tin cans off of the line. The cans are pulled up out of the materials on the belt below and thrown into a bunker. Lastly, we use our T-Tech optical scanners to help us sort out plastics one through seven and household aluminum. These scanners can sort materials in four to six seconds. They use blasts of air to move the materials onto their appropriate belts. These materials then go on to man stations for further sorting and quality control. One of these stations is our deposit line. This is where we collect all the deposit items to be returned to Sarcan, such as glass, plastic, aluminum beverage containers, and Tetra Packs. From the tip floor to material bunkers, the whole material sorting process takes approximately 15 minutes. Once we have enough of one material, we push it onto our floor conveyor belt and send it up into the baler. The materials are compressed, wrapped in wire, and sent out. We produce 150 to 200 bales per day. These bales are shipped out across North America to be made into something new. There you have it, start to finish, our process here at Loris Recycle. Thank you for taking the time to learn more about our recycling efforts here at one of Saskatchewan's largest materials recovery facilities. Remember to recycle smart and keep dangerous items out of your cart to help keep our employees safe.